Hello and welcome back to Boring Dead Gaming, where today we're going to be learning the next technique in Card Shark, which is uh, number 17, the Stacked Shuffle. And this uh, introduces something new, but also draws upon techniques that we've previously learned. So what the comps ask for here is for us to riffle through this deck and find four high cards for him. So it's either a face card or the ace. And uh, it, another complication here is that we can only move through the deck uh, in one way. We can sort of move from the end here to the, to, the, to the start if you like, but we can't go back. So we're just going to click on the high value cards as we find them. So we're going to click on the king, click on the ace, scroll a bit. Oh, went past a couple there. Got the queen and another queen, so that's fine. This is happening automatically. We don't need to worry about this part of the uh, technique. But all our f high cards are now on the bottom. So now what we need to do is utilize a technique called the uh, pincer shuffle, which is going to give the Comte all his high cards. So first of all, we start off with a normal shuffle. So we're going to hold down the left mouse button and drag down, like so. Now, we're just the once, and so now that we're here, we're going to do the pincer shuffle, which for this, you hold down the left mouse button and move up. And now we have the king. So what we need to do to get it into the comp's hand is just tap once on the left mouse button to draw an extra card. There we go. So now we're going to pincer shuffle again, moving the mouse up while we're holding it, the button down, and another tap to put it in the right hand. And we're going to do that technique twice more. Pincer shuffle, tap, and now the comp has all the high cards that we found for him. And now what we do to mark this in the deck, we're going to injog. So remember, we hold down the left mouse button and drag it to the right to injog. And now we just finish off that shuffle with a couple of downward movements. And all the cards are here. All we need to do now to finish this off, you see they're locked in place. We just shuffle down, I think, three or four times. And we're done. Now we need to draw a pattern, like we have previously done, to full Theodore. And as an additional part of this one, we also have to do a little timing-based game when we cut the deck. So I don't think it matters which of these circles we, we tap on. I think we can do either. But we need to make sure that we're hitting these circles on time. And once we've done all of those things, we'll win the hand. And the Comte will get his four high cards. And that's it. That's the, um, the stacked shuffle. So thanks very much for watching. Hopefully that will help you when you come to this part in uh, Card Shark, when you return to Corsica to face uh, King Theodore again. So, yeah, I'll hopefully I will see you next time. Bye for now.